You alright there? And today I'm, I'm going to talk about uh, Albert Goering. Someone who I've just recently looked up and to be honest with you I can't believe I've not heard of him before because I think the story of him is pretty amazing. Like, but Basically he's, he's Goering who was in the na- like one of their leaders in the Nazi party's brother. And they were both there, they grew up together. But for some reason like Albert Goering absolutely despised Nazism. Completely hated it. Absolutely against it. And he actually like he showed he was against it as well. Like say, um there's a story where there's loads of Jewish women like being forced to scrub the streets and he went along and joined and went uh, like dealt with them until the and it wasn't until the SS officer actually found out who he was that he cancelled the exercise because he didn't want to be known that he was the one that made Goering's brother like scrub the streets. Then later in his life he was I think I think he was manager or head of the Skoda factory in uh, Czechoslovakia, and he'd do stuff like he'd sign Goering, so like he'd forge his brother's signature basically, to like help them and get them off. And uh, also, also he'd like say send truckloads of vehicles up to, I mean, they weren't fully up, but like he used to send trucks up to like the concentration camps. Then once there, he'd like fill them for the Jews and just saying that you need hard labour. He'd get a few miles down the road, then he'd like like free them, just tell them to do one. He got arrested twice as well. He got arrested in the Nuremberg trials. But people who he helped came forward, testified for him, and he got it released. Then he got arrested by the Czechoslovakian government for crimes. The same thing happened again. So twice he got arrested for war crimes, and twice he got off of it because of the deeds he did. He tried to move back to Germany when he was older. But because obviously, like he struggled to find work because he was a Goering. Not many people want to hire a Goering, like. And yeah, I just think he's a pretty interesting character all around, really. And I'm surprised I haven't heard of him before. Another thing I find interesting though is the fact that him and his brother, like, grew up in the same house, and they, like polar opposites almost. You know what I mean? I find that really strange. Like, know more about that. Yeah. So if any of you could like shed further light on him for us, I'd be much obliged, like. Just cheers, just give a comment on the floor. Thanks.